Hi guys, this is Soro. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create an app to get your lucky number. Okay, it's Japan. Okay, don't take it seriously. Okay, this this is work for me, so that's why I I have created this app. So my lucky number is seven. Okay, so I'm going to select my date of birth here, and that one is five. Okay, and date is seven, and my the top word is one nine nine six. Okay, okay, and click on okay. You will see seven two ninety ninety six. I'm going to click on this. Get your lucky number. Your lucky number is seven. Fine. So that's my lucky number here. So how you can create this app? This one is not your date. That's the calculation of this uh, uh, whole number. So how I calculate this number? So I'll show you in programming. Okay, so let's see. We are going to create this app. Here we go. So first, we need to click on Start New Project, and project name is Lucky Number. Okay. So first, I'm going to use layout here. So here, I'm going to use horizontal arrangement. Okay, and make this percentage is thirty percent, like this, and make this with this fill parent. And you need to just make it center, and this one is also center. Change background color. You can use any color. I'm going to use here black, and I'm going to drag and drop date picker. So you will see here date picker. Drag and drop this button, and I'm going to change this button background color to orange, and text is DOB. Select DOB. I'm going to change font size to 20. Okay. If I select the date of birth, so we have to display my date of birth in the label. So I'm going to display it in a label. So I'm going to use a label again, and there is horizontal label, and make this fill parent. And I'm going to use here three labels. Okay, so label one for date. This one is for month, and this one for is year. Fine. Now I'm going to change this to text date, and make it. 20 fine and i'm going to change horizontal background color to something orange and click on label 2 and make it month and for third i'm going to use make it year fine and make it font size 20 for both for this one also fine now click on horizontal element and make it center and make it also center fine Now I have to get the lucky number, so I'm going to use one more label to display my lucky number here. So I'm going to make it fill parent here like this, and make this font size is 30, and I'm going to remove the text from here like this, and uh, fine. Now click on screen, and I'm going to change the background color of screen to orange. Fine. Now uh, what should I have to do? I have to use here one button to get the lucky number, okay? And I'm going to make it with this fill parent and using here text get lucky number. Get your lucky number. Fine. And I'm going to change the background color. And something orange, and no, it's not look like orange. It's good. So I'm going to change this to tell or something like this, and change their text color to white, and make this font size to at least 80. Okay, it's look good. Fine. Uh, now I'm going to uh, see how it look. You will see here. That's the design here. Now I'm going to the block section. And here I'm going to code for date picker. So whenever someone click on the date picker, and after the date set, we have to display our date in the label. Okay, here date, month, and year. So I'm going to do this. What I what I have to do? So after set the data, we have to set label one dot text. You will see here label one dot text should be click on date picker. And this one is should be date. You will get the date here. Day. That's the day here. And I'm going to copy and paste three times here. 
so this one is for level 2 and this one is for level 3 date pick a day then I have to display month and I'm going to display the year fine just cross check this one is level 1 level 2 and that one is level 3 fine okay so that's your date of birth fine now I have to calculate the number and and find the my lucky number okay so whenever someone click on the get lucky number button it means this one okay fine now I have to I'm going to change this button name so it's good lucky btn click on okay go to the block section whenever someone click on this button so we have to display the number here where enough level 4 so go to the block and set level 4 value set and what what value we have to set here so we have to set here calculation of these uh, four uh, these all values so how we uh, how we can do this so that's very easy so I'm going to use here one variable first we are going to initialize the variable and that one is lucky l u c k y that's our variable here and i'm going to assign the value to lucky is zero like this okay that's the default value here now i have to set i have to calculate the value so i'm going to use here max function okay and i have to use here three times for calculation fine so what I'm going to do I'm going to use here segment so I have to uh, remove the ca uh, calculated value okay so I'm going to show you how it's work okay if I just suppose the enter like some value like uh, click on level 1 you will see here level 1 dot text okay and I'm going to copy and paste this 1 2 3 then what I will get okay so let's see click on select DB and I'm using my April click on ok get lucky number you will see here your lucky number is 2039 so that's my not lucky number right so I have to make it like what should I have to do uh, I'm going to make it lucky number is something what I am going to do how I can I do so that's very easy way so I'm going to calculate the full value of like 9 3 0 and 2 also so how I can do this I'm going to remove here and I'm going to use here segment to separate the value okay so that's the segment here okay and what I have to do I'm going to separate the number here okay so how, I, how can I do this so I have to get the text here so how we get text so I'm going to use another maths function here to calculate the value. So here I'm going to use this one and make this one three times like this. And here I'm going to use text one value like suppose click on level one and that's the level one text. And I'm going to calculate this value first for two and for three fine that's my value here now uh, what i'm going to do that's my text and i have to get the first number okay so what i'm going to do i'm going to use here zero so i'm going to start from the one and length is going to be one fine now i have to do this for three times to get the value okay so i'm going to copy this and paste this here and paste this one again so i'm going to use a start from two and length is one and i'm going to paste this one again copy this again and paste this one here and make here start from third and length is one fine okay so we have to do it four times actually okay because we have four digit number fine and this second time and i'm to make it for four okay and here 
fine that's the code here you can see i'm i have repeated this code four times okay and but i have to change start one to one and here you can see two one here three one here i'm going to make it four one fine now go to my app here and select date of birth i'm going to make it 1996 make it seven and make it five click on okay and click on get your lucky number you will see that seven so that's very easy way to create or get your lucky number thank you so much for watching this video if you have any doubt you can add me on comment please subscribe my channel like this video have a nice day be safe bye bye